en question. Le président. The president, please be seated. The court is now back in session. Le président de l'audience. And we would like to now hand over to counsel for Mr. Nunchir to continue putting questions to the witness. Nous laissons la parole à la défense de Nunchir. Thank you, Mr. President. We only need 10 to 15 minutes more. Um, Mr. Witness, before the break, we were speaking briefly about your answer to the question of the prosecution about Ankar giving instructions about purging enemy officers. What can you tell us about these instructions, if they existed at all? What kind of form did ins these instructions reach you or any other people? Vous ont-elles été communiquées Response. Réponse. The purges of the enemies had some impact on the, our own people and our own nation that did not necessarily affect the enemies alone. alone. Ça n'a pas simplement touché. Ça n'a pas nécessairement touché uniquement les ennemis. My, my question Mr. Witness is how did these instructions reach you? Comment how did you know that such policy or plan Comment saviez-vous apparently existed? Qu'un tel plan ou qu'une telle politique existait. Response. Réponse. There were meetings. The, this kind of thing were not learned during des, education des sessions, but they were learned in meetings at the sector level. Lors de réunions qui avaient lieu au niveau du secteur. But who told you what? And when? Question. Mais qui vous a dit quoi et quand? Response. No Pense. one told me. Personne ne me l'a dit. During the sessions, when we were instructed on the class stand standpoint, and also the poor and peasant class, this kind of idea was introduced in these sessions. That, that's, that's, that's very interesting, Mr. Witness. But my question is, who instructed you to look for specific people? Qui vous a dit de rechercher des personnes en particulier? Mr. Witness. 
Mr. Witness, you gave a very general answer. My question is very specific. Who instructed you or who told you qui vous a dit to purge enemy officers? Qu'il fallait procéder à la purge d'ennemis, d'officiers ennemis. Response. Response. The people at the upper echelon, because uh, at district level, we were responsible. Uh, report, district, uh, we reported nous, to the sector and nous au sector. sector to the zone. Et le sector, lui, so la zone. we follow the instructions from the upper echelon. De supérieur. But what kind of instructions? And who were the people telling you this? Response. Response. People at the sector level who instructed this. Uh, they had to, to conduct the purchase Il and devait... thorough inspection would be carried out Faire before people would be purged. À des enquêtes, or in des other words, investigation into Faire de telles purges. Autrement the dit, on people conducts and whether the they des gens. were falling into the categories of those who had to be purged. Si Otherwise, we, uh, the other people, innocent people, would be purged unnecessarily. Des été pris dans cette purge. Mr. Willis, you're giving very general answers. Monsieur le témoin. Let me rephrase. Can you give me one, only one, example, me donner un example of un seul. an instruction from Somebody with a name, que vous auriez reçu de quelqu'un, une instruction to you, une instruction to purge, vous aurait été donnée, one specific individual, de procéder à la purge of whom it was said personne en he was a long lost soldier or maybe officer. accusé d'être un one soldat de London example, ou un please. fonctionnaire. Un exemple. Response. Réponse. There were people who instructed us, and again, those people were at the sector because we at the district secteur, level nous, had to receive district, instructions from them. But to say de. to say which particular individual I purged uh, and I key can't tell or can't say anything about this. And for the sector level, then a person by the name of Saum would be the, the one you would like to ask. But Mr. Witness, and this will be my, my, my final question, Monsieur there must be one name of a person Who, may, who might not be alive today, who was purged because of you, because of you, your action, because of you, because of you were acting at the instruction of your superior. One name. Vous avez fait sous les de vos Je veux un nom. The President, Council, you may now proceed. Council for the witness. Mr. President, good afternoon. Again, I may wish to consult or uh, may need to discuss with my client uh, before he proceeds to respond to the question. The President, you may have that time. Oui, veuillez discuter with votre client.
ชมจุมเรียบง่ายลุทิม allow me to answer to that question as follows I never received the order to purge or kill anyone. I received indeed some plan, for example, propaganda action plan where I. Parler d'objectifs, de plans, par exemple, un plan d'action de propagande, mais je n'ai jamais participé à l'exécution de qui que ce soit. I understand that, Mr. Witness, but I'm just trying to find out what is the basis of your knowledge when you were saying earlier that Ankar was giving instructions about purging enemy officers. How did you know? That such instructions existed. Comment saviez-vous que de telles instructions existaient? Le président, Monsieur le président, 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 le It was the second question after the break. How do you know such policy plan or existed? It's been answered by reference to meetings at the sector level. So this question repeats almost word for word a question that has already been put and answered by this witness. I'm, I'm merely trying from another angle, uh, Mr. President, to ask. Question to this witness, and he doesn't seem to know. But I refrain from questioning. Ça va, j'en ai terminé. Le président. The objection is sustained. The question is repetitious. The witness is now instructed not to respond to this question. Next, the chamber would like to hand over to counsel for Mr. Kiusampan to put questions to the witness. Counsel Kung Sam On. Good afternoon, Mr. President and Your Honours. I thank you for this opportunity and good afternoon, Mr. But. Chum, I have some questions for you, please. My questions are relevant to what you experienced or bore witness to during the democratic Cambodia regime. Now, regarding to your joining the revolution, and you said you were a teacher and joined the revolution in 1972. Simultaneously, in 1972, you became the deputy secretary of District 105. My question to you is. Um, what made you join the revolution? The president, uh, Mr. Witness, please hold on, and Mr. Co-Prosecutor, you may now proceed first. Uh, just to help my friend, the year that was quoted was 1970 and not 1972. Thank you. Thank you. Council. Thank you. Merci. Mr. Witness, in 1970, you joined the revolution. What made you join it? Response. Immediately after the coup d'etat, I joined the revolution. Je suis entré dans la révolution. It was in May of that year, because immediately 
or three days after the coup d'état, we could see that Car dans les jours qui ont suivi le coup d'état, this uh, effect uh, had already great impact uh, at the rural areas. Que cela avait des incidences dans les zones rurales. And uh, people joined me, and we had uh, to attend study sessions about the front et nous et nous avons participé à des éducation où l'on nous parlait du front il fallait distribuer du riz pour Mr. que les gens Kyo mangent Sampan, et monsieur Kyo Sampan including prince Norodom Sihanouk who were part of uh, this uh, movement because uh, they were uh, prince Norodom Sihanouk uh, was uh, toppled le car le prince Norodom Sihanouk avait été renversé and we couldn't move elsewhere and we had to join the other people et uh, to go to the Maki avec as uh, appealed le by Maki the Prince Nurdam Sinuk. Question, what was the purpose of joining the Maki? Question. Response. It was for pourquoi fallait-il rejoindre le maquis Fighting to make sure that Réponse. the former prince could be returned to power. Lutter pour uh, permettre to return au to the country and the council. Uh, are you saying that uh, that was the objective of your fight to bring him back to the country de votre to be in power? Faire revenir le prince pour qu'il retourne Response. au pouvoir. The president, uh, uh, Mr. Witness, uh, please uh, respond témoin. again because you made uh, a response, but then uh, the mic répondu. was not activated and you would not be heard. So please donc, do that again. Pas entendu ce que vous avez dit. Donc votre réponse, response. Le témoin. That struggle was meant to bring some light back into power. Tourner au pouvoir Council, thank de you. You mentioned in the statement of your interview document dans le procès verbal de votre audition. And the Two, three, two stroke, seventeen. This document was referred to the already by the co-prosecutor. Okay, I would like to refer to Khmer E R N zero zero three 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 rather. Zero zero three seven three four six seven. My and English zero zero four two six two zero five. And French uh, French zero zero eight eight zero one thirty five. The question was about uh, the structure of District one o five whether it was changed after nineteen seventy five. And you said that uh, before nineteen seventy five the district. Uh, structure was structure still the same and Com was uh, the secretary of the district uh, when Kyo was her deputy end of quote in your statement you classified uh, the fr front district office and the Du bureau district parties du district office. So, pour le front, can you tell the chamber, please, were these two institutions different? Des bureaux du parti pour Response. le district. Response. No, there was no such this, uh, classification non, of de, um, structure. De telle structure. Council, thank you. Or oh, you may proceed. Uh, Response: No, there was no Réponse, such classification, non, but uh, the terms uh, were used interchangeably. Council, thank you. Réponse. 
mettre comme ça. And Merci. Your statement, the same document. Toujours dans le même document. But document E3 Ou plus stroke dans 400. Dans le document E3 bar 400. French 00426175276 English 00379168-69 I would like uh, to read uh, this as follows Question When you joined the revolution at the beginning what did you do and I would like to quote uh, your response as follows when I first joined the revolution they gathered the teachers in the liberated villages and organized them in the front movement in 1970 and 1971 at the beginning I had no specific role but was still a regular teacher in my native village and commune at that time they called teachers to go to study with Anka in the jungle, and three or four months later, Anka came down to organize the front in the Kao province. Anka then was referred to as Saum, male, and Miss Mut, who were the chairperson of the deputy Respect, uh, and the deputy respectively of the Kao province. In that front moment, I knew teacher San, male, who is now still alive, and teacher Un, who is still alive also. There were other teachers whose names I do not recall. Saum and Miss Mut came down from the jungle, and they called them Anka, and a quote. I would like you to tell the chamber your understanding of the term Anka used here. Now, I would like you to tell the chamber in, as in your capacity as the secretary of the district and how you understood uh, the term Anka and Comment what it was referring Anka to and which unit uh, would be regarded as Anka. Response. To be brief. Réponse. Pour être bref. At that time, I did not époque, know who created Anka. Je ne sais pas qui a créé l'Anka. There were people who emerged from the jungle and they were well received by people at the district and people said that look Anka was now Anka was coming so we had to receive them so I can't exactly tell at which rank Anka would be holding it could be not uh, too low uh, uh, at the lower rank or higher rank because here you can say look uh, there, there are some Ankars including ah, the well, for example World Food Organization exemple, in Khmer which is Anka as we understand it. so Anka to me is a kind of um, name or a body of work Donc, or moi, an institution organization. So Anka belongs to Donc, a kind of company or une, une um, an institution. That's, that's, institution. that's what I understood voilà. the term to be. Ce que je comme Council, thank you. Ankar. I would like uh, to also ask you a question concerning the cooperative level. Merci, when it comes to cooperative, active. could a cooperative be addressed as Ankar. Pouvait-on les appeler Ankar? Response. Réponse. 
I don't think I uh, quite understand your question. Je ne pense pas avoir compris la question. But I can say that uh, Je peux vous dire cooperative, a cooperative would also be known as uh, an encar. On les appelait aussi, on pouvait être appelé because encar. cooperative was established uh, with some proper structure, which itself was called encar. Que appelait encar. Council, thank you. What about uh, the commune committee? Was a commune committee also referred to as an encar? Response. No. Commune committee would not be uh, called or referred to as an encar. But at that time, people uh, arbitrarily used uh, encar as the term to re refer to the commune committee, although it was not uh, wisely used. So, all in all, the term anka could Donc, be interpreted in broad term or in a narrow sense. Au sens large ou Question, sens what, is, what you have Question. just stated is that based on your personal experience when you went to the bus, would you refer to as anka? Est-ce qu'on faisait référence à vous? Est-ce qu'on vous appelait anka? Answer. Réponse. It is hard to say whether that is a proper or not proper, but uh, si in fact uh, it, it was used. Mais because when I was referred to as Anka, I, 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 I actually was a bit scared. Ça me faisait Council interrupt. My question is, ma question would you refer to as Anka by the people during the Democratic Cambodia regime? Sous le régime du Cambodia démocratique, vous appelez Anka. Answer, yes. Réponse, oui. Thank you. Question, Question. what about your upper level? Qu'en est-il de vos supérieurs? Answer, of course, yes. They were referred to as encar. Oui, bien sûr. On les désignait par l'appellation encar. People refer to them as Anka, but in fact, we educated the people that they were not fait, Anka, but they were the Anka representative. The Anka itself was at a higher upper echelon. De so we explained that to the haut. people for them to understand, because Anka did not refer to any individual person in particular. Pas référence à des Cancer, individus. thank you. Question, Question, based on your personal ex experience, would you Selon frequently refer to as Anka? Est-ce qu'on vous désignait souvent par l'appellation Anka? Answer. Réponse. It was a kind of a closer a reference. When a person was close to me, yes, I would be referred to as Anka. Si les gens se trouvaient près de moi, à ce moment-là, oui, ils pouvaient me désigner par encart. Question. Was there any particular Question. feature that the people or your subordinate refer to you as encart? Did you possess certain qualifications si in order for you to refer to as encart? Subordonnés qui étaient les vôtres ainsi que votre entourage vous appelait l'encart, était-ce parce que vous aviez des caractéristiques of particulières It would not uh, be réponse. actually appropriate for the people to refer to an individual as encart. I would educate them not to refer to any particular individual as encart. J'apprenais aux gens Question. à ne pas appeler des individus In reference to encart. your testimony this Question. morning, Around 9.39 minutes, matin, vers you responded to some minutes, questions put to you by the International Prosecutor au -procureur international, concerning the Krang Tatian Office. Parlé du bureau de Krang Tatian. You stated that you knew it in 1974. 
vous dites you knew about the existence of Kran avoir Tachan. appris l'existence de Kran Tachan en 1974. Is your response uh, correct? Votre réponse était-elle exacte? President, a witness, Le président, wait, témoin, veuillez attendre. La parole est proceed. à l'accusation. Sorry, Mr. President, I, I made reference to the statement in which the witness had given the date 1972 as I Merci. did not uh, refer to the time of the establishment of the Kranketian office. The question that I put to the witness is in what year that he knew the existence of the Kranketian office. If you can recall the, de the specific date, that will be great, but the month or the year is sufficient. Si vous pouvez donner une date and, uh, no, I cannot recall sous it. la forme d'une année et d'un mois, cela suffira. Le témoin, je ne m'en souviens pas. Question. Question. I like to read your written record of interview. Je vais donner lecture is, uh, de votre procès verbal d'audition. B. D. 233 93-04. In response to the question as whether you know the Kranta Chan Security Center, you replied si that I heard about the existence of the Kranta Chan Security Center after the Vietnamese arrived in 1979. Do you stand by this statement? Answer. Réponse. I stand by that statement. Je confirme mes déclarations. Question. Question. Let me confirm that you only knew the existence Donc, of Grand Tachan office after 1979. Is this correct? Du bureau de sécurité de Krang Tachan qu'après 1979. Est-ce exact? I knew about Réponse. it in 1973. J'en étais informé en 1973. However, this morning I stated that I knew of the upper qui était you knew that question. Donc, pour préciser, vous saviez que des gens étaient envoyés à l'échelon supérieur et veuillez attendre avant de répondre. Donc, vous saviez que des gens étaient envoyés à l'échelon supérieur, mais pas exactement à quel endroit ces gens étaient envoyés. Est-ce exact Réponse. Je ne le savais pas, donc cela n'est pas exact. La défense. Merci. Question. When you knew 
the existence of the Krantachan Security Center after the arrival of the Vietnamese in 1979. Is that statement correct? D'après ce que vous dites, est-ce que cette déclaration est exacte? Answer: It is. Réponse: Oui. Counsel, please repeat your response. Question: Answer: It is correct. Réponse: C'est exact. Counsel, Mr. Pechim, I have no further question for you. Thank you, Mr. President. Monsieur Pechim, je n'ai plus de questions à vous poser. Merci, Monsieur le Président. President, le président. Thank you, Mr. Pechim. Merci, Mr. Pechim. The hearing Pechim. of your testimony has come to a conclusion, and you may be excused from the court. Vous pouvez vous retirer du prétoire. And we are grateful Nous vous for sommes reconnaissants your time to testify before this chamber pour venir for one cette whole day with patience Durant and best journée, effort. Vous avez your testimony may contribute to finding the truth in this case, and we wish you all the very best, and have a safe trip back home. The hearing today has come to a conclusion. We will adjourn the proceeding now and resume tomorrow. That is to say, the 22nd of July. 2013 from 9 a.m. and for tomorrow. We Demain, will hear nous the testimony of a witness, TCW386. This information is for the parties, the support staff, and the general aux public. Parties, aux auxiliaires et aux publics. Court officer, in collaboration Monsieur with uh, WISU, please the witness for him to return to his residence or wherever he wishes to go. And please do the same for the reserve witness and have the reserve witness to return tomorrow morning before 9 a.m. And security guards, you are instructed to pay the two accused Nunji and Yen to the detention facility and have them return tomorrow morning prior to 9 a.m. As for Nunji, bring him to the holding cell downstairs, which is equipped with audiovisual means for him to follow the proceeding remotely. The court is now adjourned.